Let's begin tonight by recognizing that the state of our union is strong because our people are strong. We have created 2.4 million new jobs, including including 200,000 new jobs in manufacturing alone. And just as I promised the American people from this podium 11 months ago, we enacted the biggest tax cuts and reforms in American history. Since we passed tax cuts, roughly 3 million workers have already gotten tax cut bonuses, many of them thousands and thousands of dollars per worker, and it's getting more every month, every week. Apple has just announced it plans to invest a total of $350 billion in America and hire another 20,000 workers. The era of economic surrender is totally over. From now on, we expect trading relationships to be fair and, very importantly, reciprocal. This, in fact, is our new American moment. There has never been a better time to start living the American dream, because Americans are dreamers, too. The first pillar of our framework generously offers a path to citizenship for 1.8 million illegal immigrants who were brought here by their parents at a young age. Under our plan, those who meet education and work requirements and show good moral character will be able to become full citizens of the United States over a 12-year period. As part of our defense, we must modernize and rebuild our nuclear arsenal, hopefully never having to use it, but making it so strong and so powerful that it will deter any acts of aggression. But no regime has oppressed its own citizens more totally or brutally than the cruel dictatorship in North Korea. North Korea's reckless pursuit of nuclear missiles could very soon threaten our homeland. We are waging a campaign of maximum pressure to prevent that from ever happening. I am proud to report that the coalition to defeat ISIS has liberated very close to 100 percent of the territory just recently held by these killers in Iraq and in Syria and in other locations as well. But there is much more work to be done. We will continue our fight until ISIS is defeated. We will never fail. Our families will thrive. Our people will prosper. And our nation will forever be safe and strong and proud and mighty and free. Thank you, and God bless America.